All right, Jesse, up next, we are talking some Bengals and some Cowboys, two teams that are probably going in very different directions. We've got the Bengals minus seven and a half. We know the Cowboys have lost Dak out six to eight weeks with a thumb injury. This is big for them. I mean, this wasn't the best team ever to begin with. And now here they are with a huge hit right out of week one. Total on this one's 41 and a half. Do we fade the injury report or we just keep on trucking along with the Bengals? What's up, everybody? Don't forget about our new sponsor, Caesars Sportsbook. They're giving you up to $1,250 in a risk-free first bet and 1,000 Caesars reward points and a 1,000 Caesars tier credits. This is big time value for all new accounts. All you got to do is download the app onto your phone and use the promo code MORNINGFUL or check out the description of the video and click on the link. Well, I certainly don't think we keep on trucking along with the Bengals. Uh, in their loss to Pittsburgh last week, their offensive line looked scary. Uh, Burroughs threw four picks. He was sacked seven times. And if you watch the Tampa-Dallas game, as bad as Dallas's offense looked, their defense looked great. Um, the Bucs only uh, – they, they basically won that game with their kicker. They scored four field goals. Uh, Tom Brady threw for just 212 yards a touchdown and a pick. Um, that's a lot of points for a road favorite, the, the way they looked last week. Uh, and, and Cooper Rush will get the start for Dallas. You know, I'm not going to sit here and talk up Cooper Rush, but let's not forget that last year he made a start in replacement of uh, Dak Prescott, and they beat Minnesota 20-16 to 16 in Minnesota. He threw for 325 yards, two touchdowns, and, and one pick. Um now they're getting seven and a half points at home. That defense does look pretty good. My recommendation for this game, because it is a later afternoon game, is, uh, you know, after those uh, those guys get in on the early games, they're going to be looking for that afternoon game. They're probably going to be betting the Bengals, probably bet up that line. I think you can get as good as a nine by, by game day. So, so yeah, I'm, I'm going to wait on that and look to take the Cowboys. Yeah, maybe a lot of overreaction here because this line started at Bengals plus two and a half. Now we're seeing a minus seven and a half and 98% of the cash on the Bengals. I mean, I'm pretty sure Vegas doesn't want to pay out 98% of the betters, you know. Um, and one thing I do a lot in the NBA is fade the injury report. Everyone thinks that this happened and so now this must happen. Fading the injury report is sometimes the way to make some cash. So that's what we're going to roll with. People at home, if you want Jesse the Iceman Schultz premium plays, head over to picksandparlays.net and use that promo code NFL to save you 20% off whatever's in your cart at checkout.